you. So we have another question to do, and the question says, a bird of weight W sits on a thin rope at its midpoint. The rope is almost horizontal and has negligible mass. So it is a bird, and the weight is W. The tension in the rope is less than W by 2 equal to W by 2 between W by 2 and W or greater than W. So for this question, first of all, we have to make the free body diagram. The free body diagram will be like this. Weight will be downwards and tension will be at the strings. So now we have to break into the components. Let's take this angle as theta. You can take this theta or this theta. So according to the angle that you will take as theta, your calculation will go like go according to the angle. So according to this, this will become t cos theta, and this will also become t cos theta. So the horizontal components will goes off, and there two t sine theta, and from there also two uh, t sine theta will be there. So we will write it at two t sine theta because two components are adding each other. So we will equalize the vertical component. It will be two t sine theta equals to w. So t equals to w and two into sine theta. This two and sine theta has come into denominator. <coughs> so this is the value of tension. So the question says the rope is almost horizontal. So almost horizontal means that the theta angle that we have taken this the uh, this theta this theta will be very very near to the zero. So when sine theta in sine theta when theta is zero then sine zero equals to zero. So it becomes t equals to w. 2 into 0 and you know that when the we divide any some anything with 0 it becomes infinity so the value has increased and value is very high so it has it in this range the answer is less than w by 2 no equals w by 2 no between w2 and w no greater than w yes of course at 0 it is infinity and at ang at 0 it is infinity and for angle 1, 2 it would be greater than W. So our D answer, D option will be the right answer. We will check the mark scheme now. The mark scheme says D is the right answer. So thank you for watching this video. If you have some another doubts, you can just post it in the comment section and I will be solving those questions for you. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video.